EA Sports. It's in the game. Here we are at Wellington for the one day international between New Zealand and Bangladesh. And uh, you had a look at the pitch a little earlier, Jim. How was it? Good morning, Richie. If the batsmen play sensibly, there are some big scores to be had out here. For the seam bowlers, there won't be any great movement in this pitch, but there might be just enough if they can keep the ball in the right place. There could be some spin from the start, and as the match progresses, the ball will begin to turn a lot more. A tough call. Perhaps a good toss to lose. Well, that appears to be the state of the pitch. Back to you, Richie. Nash to bowl the first ball of the day. Javed Omar is out for duck. Habibul Bashar awaits his first ball. Habibul Bashar is off the mark. Mehrab Hussain awaits his first ball. Mehrab Hossein is now facing. That's straight up in the air. Out. No. Dropped. That's a lovely way to get off the mark. Bangladesh will be looking to blast away from the start with fielding restrictions in place. Tuffy to begin a new over. There it goes. That's the first boundary for Mehrab Hossein. Mehrab Hossein is now on strike. That was a super shot. I really didn't think it was too bad a ball. Long hop and a spash for four. That went like a rocket to the fence. Well, he's only been out there for a few minutes and he timed that perfectly. Oh. That's four more. Beautifully played. Fantastic shot there. He knew it was four as soon as he struck it. Well, the field is not going to cut that off. Mehrab Hussain has moved into the 20s and is starting to look far more relaxed. Eight overs are left in the innings. Nash to bowl the last of his allotted overs. That's gone high in the air. That's the first boundary for Habibul Bashar. cleared the infield. That was a really confident shot. Beautifully played. Head over the ball, wait forward, a textbook shot.
confident appeal. The umpire raised his finger and he's out. Habibul Bashar goes for only nine. Emanuel Islam takes guard. Nash at the start of his run-up. and dispatch for four. He can't afford to bowl at him there. Fantastic shot there. He knew it was four as soon as he struck it. Seven overs are left for Bangladesh. Tuffy to bowl the last of his allotted overs. That's gone high in the air. Hardly seemed to hit that, yet it sailed over the ropes. It doesn't really matter if it goes in the air if you hit it that far. He's worked that into the gap. It's a mix-up with the batsman. I think he was easily back in the crease there. Played into the gap. Nine runs came from that over by Tuffy. Here comes the first change in the bowling. That's gone high in the air. That's a great shot. He really plays those shots off the back foot quite brilliantly. Well, that was a perfectly played cut. Kept on top of it, rolled the wrist, and it just sped to the fence. He picked that up beautifully. The bowler won't like that one little bit. Dispatch for four. Picked up very early by Mehrab Hossein. The bowler didn't do too much wrong there. It was just an excellent shot. The total is now two for 64. Oh, That's the end of the fifth over. We're about to see a change in the bowling. He's worked that into the gap. That takes him into double figures. It's a mix-up with the batsman. He's got it into the gap. Tory to Mehrab Hossein. Yeah. 
Batori to Amanul Islam. Four overs are left in the innings. Cairns to begin a new over. And the batsman didn't look at all comfortable there. That is good bowling. Keep it tight. Good line and length. Make the batsman play. Mayra Hossain waiting at the striker's end. It's in the air. Oh, the bowler won't like that one little bit. For the crowd, the hook is a spectacular action shot. Pushed into the gap. He can enjoy this as he's had to work very hard for it. That brings up his half century. Trouble here. It never looked like being a run there. Emanuel Islam makes his way back to the dressing room. Akram Khan is the next man in. Akram Khan facing his first ball. Outstanding catch. Excellent catch. The batsman can't believe he held on to that. Akram Khan makes his way back to the dressing room. First boundary for Neymar Ramal. He's worked that into the gap. There's a mix up with the batsman. Three overs are left for Bangladesh. Neymar Rahman facing. It's in the air. He found the gap with precision. That was good batting. He picked his spot, didn't try to smash it, just stroked it through the gap. That's gone high in the air. That takes him into double figures. It's a mix-up with the batsman. The third umpire's been called for. He's not a good judge of a run, is he? Batori continues. Mayra Hossain waiting at the striker's end. Tory at the start of his run-up. Out. No. Dropped. That's a bad miss. He did the hard part by getting into good position, but put it down. Naimo Rahman is now on strike. Safely taken by Harris. For those of you watching at home, that's a good example of how to take a catch. Eight runs came from that over for Bangladesh. There's a change in the bowling for New Zealand. Harris only over pitched very slightly, but it was punished. That was a nicely timed shot. You don't need to smash the ball to the boundary every time. That could be a very painful blow.
He smashed that one right out of the ground. Another one of those, and this bowler could be out of the attack. It's high in the air. There's a nice bit of timing. There's a perfect example of how to play that shot. He deserved four runs for New Zealand are making a change in the bowling. That's a fantastic strike. It doesn't really matter if it goes in the air if you hit it that far. Adams to Khaled Mashur. Nash out at long off. It's high in the air. Wasn't a very good delivery. He gave the batsman too much room there. Four runs. Mayra Hussain is now on strike. A good catch from Cairns. He took a great catch there. The batsman will be gutted about it. Mehrab Hossein eventually goes for 71. That was a fine innings for Mehrab Hossein. Mushfika Rahman awaits his first ball. That's straight up in the air. That's the first boundary for Mushfika Rahman. At the end of the innings, Bangladesh have scored 6 for 118. That was a really good performance out there. So they need 119 to win from 60 balls. Over pitched and four. First boundary for Fleming. Fleming is now facing. So to sum up then, Bangladesh win by 61 runs.